There are three ways to create a scene. With pre-programmed switches, with easy step and with easy time. This tutorial explains the second option. Please note that you can modify an existing scene with the same method. Start by clicking on New Scene. Choose the name of your scene, here we'll use Easy Step. Click on Empty to create a blank scene and then click on OK plus Edit. The scene editor opens. Open the windows Fixtures, Channels, Easy Step and Preset. The Fixture window shows your equipment with different selection buttons. In the Channels window, you can modify all the DMX channels and decide how to trigger them. In the Preset window, you have several tabs allowing you to modify multiple channels at once with fewer clicks. At this point, the Easy Step window shows one step. It means that your fixtures can be only in one state for now. We will create a new step by clicking on the plus icon. Select the fixtures that you want to use, either using the mouse or the buttons. Here, we select the eight moving heads. In the channel window, you have now the choice between Easy Step or Easy Fade buttons. Drag and drop one of them while maintaining the control button and hover the channels on which you want to apply this effect. With the preset windows, play around with different tabs and options to create the visual effect you want. Note that it's usually faster and easier to use the preset windows than the channel window. In this example, we'll choose a position and a gobo for the moving heads. The icon, show the light beam, activates all at once the dimmers, shutters and iris of all fixtures. Now select or create another step and using the same method, give another state to your fixtures. For example, you can make a sweep effect where the first step is the starting point and the second step the end point. To play your scene, click on the play icon. Note that the DMX channels are moving accordingly. Now, if you want, you can add a fade. This means adding a soft transition between two steps. Close the scene editor and save changes. Your scene is now created and you can access it through the main interface.